political fireworks. It's already war of words between the Bharatiya Janata Party and the Congress over Rahul Gandhi's visit. Party chief Malikarjun Khadge from the Congress has reacted and said, this is a double-engine disaster and autocracy. Modi is suppressing Rahul Gandhi's healing touch. Let me explain what Kharge is basically saying here. Yeah, double engine disaster is referring to the double engine sarkar of uh, the Bharatiya Janata Party at Manipur, which is at state level and at the center, of course, and autocracy that he's blaming on the government of the center. And that they are not permitting, because he's from the Congress Party, they deliberately do not want him to go, is what the Congress Party is claiming. He's also targeting Prime Minister Modi directly and saying Prime Minister Modi is suppressing Rahul Gandhi's healing touch. Uh, now, the Congress Party was trying to portray that Rahul Gandhi landing up in Manipur at a time when the situation is so sensitive, when the clashes and killings are still on, that Rahul Gandhi wanted to give a healing touch to the people, to the distressed families, and look how he's not being permitted. Bharatiya Janata Party, meanwhile, has also reacted. The BJP has said, and I'm quoting the BJP now, cops have asked Rahul Gandhi to take chopper, but he denied threat to Rahul due to the stir against the visit. They are saying that there is a protest against his visit. He was uh, advised that he should be taking a helicopter, but he denied and he wanted to go by route, alleging that he wanted this photo opportunity. So full-on war of words, but the visuals are for you to see. Rahul Gandhi is currently in Imphal, wanted to be the families. He's not being permitted. According to the police, there is security reasons right now, but Congress netas are saying this is deliberate because the BJP government does not want him to go ahead. Rahul Gautam is joining for the latest. Rahul, while Rahul Gandhi is uh, there on the ground, what are his supporters? saying right now over social media. Well, the entire Congress party uh, is now attacking BJP, saying that uh, a compassionate uh, act uh, uh, by Rahul Gandhi where he decided to visit uh, right-affected people is now uh, being stalled uh, 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 by BJP government merely because they don't want to see the reality uh, uh, to be exposed uh, by, uh, by Rahul Gandhi and therefore this only shows that how dictatorship is going on in the country where an, uh, a leader uh, wants to go, uh, you know, go out and meet, uh, and you know, those families uh, who have already been dis dis displaced because of the ongoing violence in uh, Manipur. But uh, the, uh, the the double engine government of Manipur is stalling that particular visit, mainly because of political reasons. In fact, the Congress Party has decided now that uh, they're going to uh, launch an offensive uh, on this issue and going to corner the government, saying that this only shows that how disturbed. Uh, uh, Manipur, is, Manipur is at this point of time when a single person who is going in his own car along with security is not being permitted and this only shows that how normalcy has not returned in the state of Manipur uh, despite the fact that government is trying all uh, you know their measures for past 56 uh, days and this only shows a complete uh, failure of state and central government that they are not able to contain the situation and, and the situation is not even conducive now that Rahul Gandhi can visit and meet those displaced people. Stay on with me, uh, Rahul, because I want to listen, our viewers to listen in again to the superintendent of police, a senior police official from Manipur Police, who's taken the call to not give clearance, saying there is a serious security risk. I cannot put Rahul Gandhi at risk right now, and uh, he's giving reasons for that about the sensitive situation. Here's what the cop has to say. Reason is since morning. A head firing has taken place when villagers from the valley side had gone to towards the hills, towards the foothills. Foothills may Chuchanpur district or Cookie Brothers are there. Okay. They might be having apprehension that people are coming, no matter with good intention for agriculture. But after third maker incident, communal class, the trust we had enjoyed over the last so many years since time immemorial has snapped. Now, if, we, if, I, if I go within my jurisdiction, close to the border with five, six vehicles, the message or the rather rumor that is spread across is, now miscreants seem to have come to attack Chuchanpur side, Chuchanpur villages. You're saying that Rahul now, Gandhi's cavalcade can spread a rumor? That yes, exactly. Exactly. Chuchan. Reason is since morning, a head firing has taken place when villagers from the valley side had gone to towards the hills, towards the foothills. Foothills may... Chuchanpur district or Cookie Brothers are there. Okay. They might be having apprehension that people are coming, no matter with good intention for agriculture. But after third maker incident, communal class, the trust we had enjoyed over the last so many years since time immemorial has snapped. Now, if, we, if, I, if I go within my jurisdiction close to the border with five, six vehicles, 
the message or the rather rumor that is spread across is now miscreants seem to have come to attack Chuchanpur site, Chuchanpur villages. You are saying that Rahul now, Gandhi's cavalcade can spread a rumor that yes, the exactly, is attacking exactly. Right now you see tires burning and you see some people who are saying Rahul Gandhi go back. They don't want the Neta right now in Manipur. This is the anger on the streets right now. Let's listen into what they are saying. Remember, there has been anger against uh, the Nathas as well. And now Rahul Gandhi and the party claims they wanted to give a healing touch. But uh, the police has quoted security issues. And we just heard the senior police official. Um, and uh, my information is he was the superintendent of police of Impal. And he's saying that to cross into Churchanpur, remember because there are ethnic clashes between different communities, the cavalcade with so many cars going can be seen as some sort of uh, 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 an incorrect messaging that it could be rumor mongering there that uh, these could be seen as attacker. The situation is extremely sensitive. We cannot permit the cavalcade and the convoy to go ahead into different areas. Uh, there has been arson and violence that are being reported even now in different parts of Manipur and therefore it is best advised to him to head back to the airport. Now the convoy is heading to the airport but will he stay there? or uh, will he return to Delhi, uh, that we'll try and get a clarity from. Mosmi Singh is uh, on the ground right now. Mosmi, so there appears to be some protesters who are saying we don't want Rahul Gandhi right now in Manipur. He needs to go back. Uh, the security personnel are saying that we cannot risk the situation. Uh, what is it looking like right now? Where are you? Where is the convoy at present? Mosmi. Yes, can you hear my voice? Yes, yes, Mosmi, go ahead. I, I missed your question. Uh, so we are being told that uh, we heard what the senior police official are saying. We, we saw some people who are protesting against okay. Rahul Gandhi. Uh, so what is the next step then for the Congress party? So right now, Pooja, the, the latest update is uh, that it's uh, the Rahul Gandhi cavalcade. Uh, in fact, all the protesters marched with the uh, cavalcade. Hmm. Uh, ahead of Rahul cavalcade. And now Rahul Gandhi is heading back uh, to Impal. Uh, the, uh, what's going to lie ahead, they, they uh, uh, yes. still need to plan. But it is clear that Rahul Gandhi is heading back to Imphal. He is not going to Surachanpur by road. Okay. Also, Moirang is not possible by road now. Uh, we will have to wait and see whether the Congress takes the chopper route uh, to get Rahul Gandhi.